Software and Computer Museum in Kiev, Ukraine. Software and Computer Museum is located in Kiev. This is a local community-run organization for everyone interested in software, computer industry, technology and innovation. Computer and Software Museum often serves as a perfect venue for organizing various seminars, excursions, meetups and conferences that are always worth a visit. Regardless of your background and occupation, everyone will find an event to their liking. We tell the history of software and computers on the example of the exhibits of our museum. We believe that it is the software and the idea of its creation that have become the key to the computerization of the world. And today software is the cause of hardware development all over the world. There are many rhetorical questions in the world, what came first, music or dance? Grain or adult plant? Computer or software? You can argue for a long time, and you can see and find the answer to the last of them once, in the software and computer museum. After all, here you can see what accomplishments pushed the developers need for software. And also to be imbued with the spirit of the history of those things that have now become an integral part of the life of each of us, and see where it all began. After all, at the software and computer museum, fans of their craft, the founders of the museum, personally collected more than 100 rare exhibits of computers, game consoles, computer units and even robots. The founders washed every key on their own, checked every board, and breathed new life into these attic dinosaurs. And indeed, being in a museum does not even give the impression that you are looking at inanimate exhibits. Each of these kids behind the window seems to be looking at you, and it seems that he is about to grab his sleeve and tell his unique life story. And tell them there is oh how much. For example, the pride of the collection, Apple II, could tell the world the life story of its owner, who in 77 enthusiastically clicked on the keys of this Lolo, the first serial PC at the time. And the Vixen computer which came out and practically marked the beginning of the end of the Osborne Corporation, probably. Could tell like no other how the star of this once mega-famous brand faded. However, we will not spoil about all the exhibits, it is better to come and hear about it from the guide. The coolest thing is that the Software and Computer Museum has collected equipment from more than one era. In this room you seem to fall into the loop of time, because where else can you see that next to it, on one shelf, was an old computer and what it has evolved into. And at the end of such a chain of technical evolution, a friendly and somewhat temperamental jiba robot awaits each visitor. Reaching the end of the exhibition, everyone will have either a little sad or nostalgic mood. But at the same time, pride will creep into the ants pride for your ancestors who started this difficult path of technological progress, for contemporaries who did so much to increase it and hope for successors. An empty shelf is waiting for their technological masterpieces in the software and computer museum. Like us and join us at Xtreme Collections for more fun and knowledge.